The bars look yummy, but be careful. When it comes to edibles, there really can be too much of a good thing. Did you just come here from Kansas and you haven't smoked pot in, in a decade? Then you need to have half a square. You know, if you come in here and eat one of our bars and go hit the ski slopes, you're not getting off the chairlift. You're just gonna go around and around. The production of infused edibles and other non-smokable products has taken off, making up nearly 40% of all recreational pot sales. I got a two edible limit per person right now. It's easy to see the appeal. No smoke, no stench, no cough, no bongs. You like peach ones too, like the peach dreams? Okay. How about the chocolate? I like the chocolate. Business is booming. It sure is legal, but is it the right thing to do? What I'm trying to figure out in my own mind, is this innocent or insidious? Do I think this is better than a beer? Yeah. The beer has zero healing properties. That you're, sounds you're like rationalization to me. I personally don't have an issue whether you're doing it recreationally or whether you're doing it for medicinal reasons. Just like anything else in this world, as long as you handle it responsibly, the emphasis falls back on you, personal freedom.